the coach in our football matches he is so strict that he takes practice sessions with the footballers as well so what does he do he places three players at these three points the first player say he is placed at a point a with the x coordinate at 5 and the y coordinate at 2 and he places the second and third players at point c and point b with the coordinates at minus 2 comma 3 and 3 comma minus 4 now he tells them to pass the ball amongst themselves so the player a passes the ball to the player c so this is how the ball passes from the player a to the player c now if we trace the path of the ball that is going from player a to player c you will see that it is creating a line segment now we can name this line segment as ac because it is joining the points a and c so we can name this line segment as ac now the player c passes the ball to the player b so now again you can see that the path can be traced and this path is a line segment now you can name this line segment as well what will you name it you can name it as cb or bc because this line segment is joining the point c and b so you can name it as cb or bc now the player b passes the ball back to player a so again you can see that there is a line segment created this path from which the ball is passing is creating a line segment now we can name this line segment as well what will you name it it is joining the points b and a so you can name it as ba or again ab so you can see that this is the path that is created by the ball first from a to c then c to b and then from b to a again so this is actually what can you tell me what shape is this creating well you can see that this is a triangle and a b and c are acting as the vertices of this triangle so this is how we construct the triangle on a graph paper what did we do well first of all we plotted three vertices say a b and c with respective x and y coordinates and then we joined ab bc and ca that is those line segments to form the triangle abc so you can take any three random points on a graph paper and then you can join them as line segments and then you can create a triangle using those three points